What's up guys? Taylor Watkins, Omega Custom Tackle. I told you I was gonna bring y'all some more about the buzz bait. This is the Alpha Shad buzz bait. These are the last few little final touches that I like to do this buzz bait. Um, I got a toad on it right now. But I think this is like some more in-depth kind of things that maybe a lot of people don't do their buzz baits. And uh, I hope you might learn something. So Alpha Shad, like we talked about before, has got two two blades on it just like that it makes four individual little little blades there you got you got uh, two that work independently so the first thing that I like to do is I take me a good pair of pliers get you a good pair this one's got a little spot in it right here with a little notch right there see that and I take that little notch and I put it right here on my on my little rivet and I put it down in that thing and just squeeze it as hard as you possibly can and what you want to do is you want to flatten that rivet right there where it doesn't move where it won't slide up and down it makes it stay stationary so that's that's the first thing that I do the next thing that I do is I take my pliers and I put it on the side of that rivet and I squeeze it and I pop it off like that just pop it off like that and what you want to do is you want to scar that rivet up. You want to give that rivet some some scarring and some little indentions and stuff on it. Make sure it's flat though. Make sure it stays flat. You don't want to twist it. You don't want to bend it down. Make sure it stays good and flat. You want everything good and flat. The next thing that I do is I split these two apart, these two blades. And like, as you can see, I've already done this one. I've been throwing this one put my pliers on it and I start doing the same thing on this one just go as far around it as you possibly can and what you want to do is you want to scar that thing up do the next one take it put it on there pull it off do the same thing on the top as well get that little bead out of your way take it you just want to get some of that paint just get it rough get it good and rough that's all you want to do do it up here on the top as well and so what you're wanting to do is get those things where they're where they're grinding against each other uh the other thing is wherever you get these they're not going to be touching these blades are not going to be touching they're going to be kind of bent up or bent down or whatever so what i do is i move this little guy all the way just like this I take my pliers, and what you want to do is just squeeze these two together and make them flat. Do the same thing on the bottom. Take it, squeeze them together, make sure they're touching. So what that's going to do is, that's where you get your squeak. Everybody talks about they want their buzz bait to squeak and squall. Well, it may not squeak right off the bat where you do that, but the more you throw it, the more it's gonna squeak. So you wanna try and get these things touching as much as possible. Just mash them all down, mash them all together. Make sure they're all together. Now this particular buzz bait has got a little different, different sound to it than most. You know, a lot of them has got a squeak, 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 squeak. I like to say that this one's got more of a clack to it. So, it's got a slight little squeak, but hear how whenever it slows down, it's got a little different sound to it. And these blades are gonna clack together. Whenever you can hear it whenever you're reeling this buzz bait, it's gonna clack together and pop together. Now there's no other buzz bait out there that's got that same sound. Most of them are gonna have a clacker on it where it's just clack, 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 clack. This has got a very unique sound to it. This is a very unique buzz bait. A lot different than most of the normal buzz baits that you would normally throw. And if you know anything about fishing, anything different is better. If you've got something different, you're gonna get more bites. Thanks for watching guys. Go check out the Alpha Shad Buzz Bait at omegacustomtackle.com. Get you some, we've got quarter ounce, we've got seven sixteenths. Go get you some, outfish your buddy. See you guys. Appreciate it.